On this episode of Gauges and Gasoline, we're installing clearance lights on my 2011 Ram 1500. <laughs> oh my god. Did you hit the wire? So you don't actually have to remove your whole headliner. You can partially remove it. I just did it because I do have a repair I have to make to mine. And it does make it easier to access when you're running all your wires and stuff. Next, you're going to put some tape down and mark each light where you're going to be drilling into the roof. So I already have my lights all marked out on my tape. And I'm actually just going to use self-drilling screws. Screw all these down to the roof and then I'll remove them and go ahead and drill my center hole. You're gonna probably want to triple check your lights and make sure they're exactly where you want them because once you screw these in, that's it. You have a hole in your roof. You can even uh, mark your, your holes by using the gasket if you want. I'm using it to mark my center hole. I'm gonna punch my center hole about right here and it's gonna be about a one inch round and that's where the wire is gonna go through with the uh, socket. Done is getting ready to run the electrical and to run the wires through the holes and then reinstall the clearance lenses on top. Reason being is because being that I have the white LEDs instead of the amber, I would like for when I unlock my truck, when my headlights come on, that the clearance lights come on with it. I think it'll give it a cool effect. But let me know in the comments below, how are you wiring up your clearance lights? So we did actually get some rain in the last hour, and I've also ran the water hose over the truck and sprayed it down pretty good and no water came through the roof at all. Like the, the seals uh, with this kit is really holding up well, so I'm super excited about that. So I actually removed the grill and I'm removing the headlights so I can get to the wiring back here. And I'm gonna try to run my wiring either alongside or through the fender, that way you doesn't see it. So if you found value in this video, hit that like button so someone else can find it. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Next, you're going to put some tape down to mark where each light's going. And... Go again. Uh, put some tape down to mark each light where you're going to be drilling into the hood. It's not a hood. <laughs> You're gonna put some tape down to mark where each light is. See, I get lost after the light. What do you want to do after the light? The light's up there. Okay, you're, gonna mark, you're gonna mark the tape. You're gonna mark the tape where the light goes. When you're drilling a hole. No. Next. <laughs> Next, you're gonna mark 
you're gonna don't record I'm, I'm just practicing next you're gonna put some tape down and mark where each light is to indicate where your drilling is gonna be no that's stupid Ugh.